Hey guys, welcome back to another tech tip. I'm Aaron from MyFastPC and today we're gonna to show you how to change your wallpaper on your computer. Check it out. So the first thing you're gonna to want to do is find out what your resolution is on your monitors in order to get the best uh, cropped photo or the best look of the photo or whatever you're wanting to set as your wallpaper. So first thing you want to do is go ahead and right click anywhere on the desktop, click on display settings as you can see here. And then what you'll want to do is come down towards the bottom and click on the little blue link that says advanced display settings. Go ahead and left click on that. What that's going to do is it's going to bring up a little bit more information as to what resolution you have, what kind of uh, aspect ratio, etc. You're going to want to find where it says resolution. In this case, you can see it's 1920 by 1080, so it's a 1080p screen. So we've got that information, so you're going to want to go ahead and click the X out of that. So now we're going to look at how to apply the actual picture or make it as the wallpaper. So what you're going to want to do is right click anywhere on an empty desktop space come on down and left click on personalize. This is gonna open up another window. And in this window, it's gonna display a bunch of information as to uh, backgrounds. But in the middle, you'll see a picture bar has a bunch of pictures listed and then it's gonna have browse. Go ahead and click on browse. It's gonna open up another menu. Now, if you've downloaded your picture from like Google Chrome, it's typically gonna be in the downloads folder. Otherwise, it's gonna to default to the pictures folder. So go ahead and choose whichever file you want, whichever picture you want. And you go ahead and click choose picture. And then right here, as you can see, after you click choose picture, it's going to go ahead and set it for all monitors or set it for the monitor. If you want to select individual monitors, what you'll want to do is just, uh, as you can see on the bar, you've got the little pictures right there. Go ahead and right click on a specific picture, and then you have the option to either set it for all monitors or you can set it for individual monitors. Hey guys, thanks for checking out that tech tip. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you hated it, thumbs down. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. We got new content coming out every Tuesdays and Thursdays. Also, don't forget to hit the notification button that YouTube's released to get that notification. Just a quick question of the day before you go. What do you love most about Windows 10? Leave your answer in the comment section below. We will see you next time.